are about race mile 28. So the car just went by. He's running good, but like I said, it's also a little bit of strategy. Uh, you can't push too hard at the beginning. It's a 250 mile race. It's tough, it's hot, nasty terrain. So you gotta be smart. All right, that's the second class 12, and right now, by my watch, uh, we've got a five minute margin. We're gonna stick around for the third place car and see how we are. Literally, race court, like I can spit to it. It's that close, you know, there's no barricades, there's no cones, there's no special access to be right here. We're at race mile 90 at Morelia Junction. Uh, there's a lake bed right on the other side of this hill. So they're gonna come running in here. They're currently at race mile 76. And they had a really good uh, lead and apparently had a flat tire somewhere. Don't know what caused it or what happened, but they were out of the car for about four or five minutes changing the tire. So we'll see how they come through here at 90 and how they reset and regroup. Second right now, but still ways to go. We are here in Mexico having way more fun than we would be if we stayed home in California for the weekend. I couldn't be more happy actually right now, kind of like beside myself, getting to sit inches away from cars going by at like 100 miles an hour over whoop de woos and jumps and throwing huge rooster tails. So I decided to just take a walk in nature. Okay, we were first, we were in the lead, and then uh, we, got, we had the flat, we had the first flat, which was okay, we were still in the lead, and then um, the second flat, which, which killed us, we were on the dry leg bed. But you didn't get stuck out there. No, we got close to it though, That's we were just running around on the bare rim, and then finally we stopped, pulled over, got the jack out, but every time we went the jack out, it slipped, and the car would roll forward, and we finally got it, so that's what killed us. We live in America where it's supposed to be the land of the free, but freedom exists here in Mexico where you can do this all day long on a Saturday and get back to the beach by 3 o'clock. Well, that was definitely cooler than I thought it was going to be. You got to try this. Oh shoot, here comes another one. second place. A little disappointed with all the flats that we had and little minor mistakes that I had, but, uh, but uh, it's desert racing. It's always fun. So we're still uh, leading the points, going into the Baja 1000 in the lead and, uh, and trying to win that one and uh, finish up this uh, championship. Yeah.